big story tonight. Should local law enforcement be allowed to spy on your cell phone? The Erie County Sheriff faced some tough questions about privacy today. You may not know it, but the Erie County Sheriff's Office is using a device that can track your cell phone. News 4's Alicia Rodriguez is here with this story that's all new tonight at 5. Alicia. Donna Jackie, the Erie County Legislature wants to know what many of you have also asked. How much information are these devices gathering and who they're gathering it from? We live in a mobile world, and while we are nearly constantly taking in information through our devices, they're also giving out information. The Erie County Legislature wants to know how much of that information the Sheriff's Department has access to. A lot of folks are very concerned, uh, and uh, I know we need to have some answers. Back in 2008, the legislature authorized the use of a Homeland Security grant to purchase cell phone tracking equipment. Sheriff Tim Howard says the intent of the technology is for emergency use to quickly track down a dangerous suspect or missing person. In that process, much like a radio trying to tune in a station, it scans through all the signals in a certain area. It is not used to monitor conversations from a cellular phone, nor do we use the device to grab any text messages from those cellular phones. It's only used to locate the phone. Although Sheriff Howard made the intent clear, he wasn't willing to share the full scope of how the device is used and what it's capable of doing. To answer that question would probably be to educate the public, including the criminal members of the public, on how to avoid the use or the efficiency of the device, so I respectfully uh, will not answer. The sheriff maintained that aside from emergencies, the device is only used under a court order or warrant. There are six people in the department that are trained and authorized to use it, but his word isn't enough to convince everyone. I still need assurances, physical proof, other than uh, the sheriff's word, and I'm not questioning whether, he, whether he's an honorable man, but, but I need evidence that, that this is being used appropriately. As for what's next, that's not really clear. Legislator Burke and others plan to find other ways to get information on that technology. Reporting live, Alicia Rodriguez, News 4 at 5.